Hey guys, what's up? It's the Mario Sanders and I'm showing you guys how to install too many items for 1.73 for multiplayer and for single player. So what we're going to do first is we're going to go down here. We are going to download for 1.73. And it is going to, we're going to have to wait for a time and everything. But, uh, we'll just click on this when it's done. And it will download. So you go over here. And there it is downloaded. So now what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to get, uh, go to your Minecraft folder, open your Minecraft folder. Go to the and I'll show you where you have to go. Uh, library, application support, and there's my Minecraft folder. I'm gonna once I uh, learn how to use my Mac, we are going to get rid of the bin folder, put that in the trash, and we are gonna load up Minecraft. So yes, we're gonna log in. Okay, so it's gonna update now. Uh, update the bin folder. So it's gonna be doing that. And what we really want to look at for this is the Minecraft .dir file. Now, most people for this, what they do is they, okay, so we have this open right now, let's just close this. And you need to have Minecraft closed when you're doing this. Um, they put in a command by going to the terminal. Let me just do this. They put in commands for the terminal, but you do not have to do that. A simpler way, which I found you can do, is you have to compress the Minecraft jar file, and then get rid of the jar file. Then unzip it, so it becomes a folder and then you're going to have to correct it by putting dot jar at the end of it and when it comes up with this do you want to change it to dot jar at the end add so now what you have is you have the exact same thing you would get from the temporary file but except now you have it for pretty much everything now we're also going to have to get rid of the meta.inf so get rid of that so now we have this okay so I'm going to too many items now let's hang on okay too many items and Here's all the classes. So, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to take all the classes from the too many items file that you downloaded and just drag it into the Minecraft.jar and any files that say replace, replace it. Okay, so now you see all the too many items classes are in here. We are going to go back to Minecraft, open this up, go to single player, and we'll just open dam. Okay, it is uh, really dark, and I don't think, yeah, it's not. But as you see here, I can go and there it is. Uh, too many items is in use. I have everything here and I can scroll through it just to show you guys. Everything is there. Now, what I can also do is turn it off and on. Uh, by pressing O, you can turn it off and on so it appears, just appears, and you just have the normal thing here. Press O and it appears. So that's how you get it to work for single player. Most people know how to do this, but now I'm going to show you how to get it to work for multiplayer. Okay. So. Now what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to close Minecraft again. Let's close. Go back here. And once you open too many items at least once, you're going to have this text file called too many items. Now if you look over here, you're going to have the give command, which is what, uh, which is um, the uh, data file which Minecraft reads when it's giving you something. Now normally, when you're doing this, uh, if I can find it, you know, it will have this it will have this zero right here. Now, to get this to work on multiplayer, what you're going to have to do? Get rid of the zero. Just completely get rid of the zero. So all that is left is slash give bracket one bracket space bracket two bracket. Now, if we go into a multiplayer server, as you'll see here, um, my server is down. Um, okay, I guess we'll try this one then since I am striking out with servers. 46.182.120.86 Okay, let's get in here, this one works. And, oh actually, did I? Actually I might have to look at something. Yeah, wait, hang on. Oh, there we go. See, it says you do not have access to that command. I think I've been in this server. Maybe, I'm not sure. But, as you see, it says you don't have access, but that does not mean I can do this. Um, I promise you guys, if you take this into a server which allows you to actually spawn it, this will work. Um, I will just close this now, get that done. But, just remember what you're going to have to do first. Get rid of the bin folder. Uh, hang on, I think I have to save this. I'll save that. Uh, save. It should work. Okay, what you have to do is you have to get rid of the bin folder. Just get rid of that, put it in the trash. Uh, load Minecraft up again, so it updates. Then download too many items uh, for 
I will put the link to the form in the description below so you can check that out. Uh, you're gonna, then what you're going to do, you're going to have to do is go in here. You're going to have to get rid of your Minecraft.jar file, uh, compress it, unzip it, so it comes a folder. Go over here, make it .jar, press add, open the folder, then go to your downloads, wherever it is, and take all the too many items, bring that back in here, replace any files that need replacing, open Minecraft, and it will work. See, if you guys have any errors with this, please leave a comment. Uh, also, just a reminder, for multiplayer, what you need to do, and this is most important, Minecraft needs to be shut down, and what you need to do is you need to go to oh god I don't need to do that um too many item too many items and you will have to load too many items by uh playing it first in single player go here get rid of the zero and then all you should have left is the slash give that and I, I'll put that in the description as well so if you guys want to copy it from here that is, that is all you need in the give um, slash command so all you need is that and then it should work on multi multiplayer if the people allow it. Make sure you save the text file as well so it saves that. But that should work, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Hope this helped. Next tutorial will be installing Zob Zom's Fly Mod. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that. And I will see you guys later.